Welcome to Crystal Info Code UK. This episode will be looking at uh, making pop-up windows. Uh, if you like that kind of thing, the first thing is I've got. I'm going to do it from. If I click a button on the screen, it will make a, a new window. So the first thing I need to do is to select the button that I want it to be, and go down to Actions, and then go down to Link to New Window. And then if I call up the item, I can say this is the name of the window. Uh, do I want it to auto close? I can link it to a page I've already made. I've got a page over here called New Window, which just has a picture on it, and I want the page to be 200 pixels by 200 pixels. And I can suggest, do I want toolbars on it? So I'm going to say no for that. Do I want scroll bars? Yes. Do I want it to be resizable? Yes. Uh, and do I want to use a link? Well, no, I don't want to go anywhere from there. So let's see what happens when we do that. So we just go to preview in browser and we look at it in Safari and there's a button and when I click on it up will come this window there and you can move it around and see what happens uh, there. So I've linked to a new window. So if we close that off, so if I don't want that, another way is to have an automatic pop-up happen when I launch the page. So the way I do that is go to the page uh, window and go down to page actions and then I go uh, along to down to it and go down to uh, pop-up window down at the bottom and this again tells me the window I can select the page I want to go so I'm going to do the same page this one's quite useful because I can position it on the page so I'm going to have it 100, 100 pixels across and 100 pixels down again I can have the toolbars selected scroll bars resizable I could put a delay on it uh, and a close on it uh, as well but let's see what happens if we preview that in the browser of course you need to make sure that you don't have the block pop-ups uh, option working on your browser otherwise this won't work so up comes the page and up comes this window as well so just to check that you don't have the block pop-ups working on your browser uh, and if somebody does have that on their browser then they won't be able to see this pop-up window uh, anyway so we close that off we can then go back to there and you can just play around with these settings with different kinds of pop-ups uh, at various points and you can combi combine automatic pop-ups from the page and still have separate pop-ups appearing from each individual item so that's me at crystalinfo.co.uk you can find me on my website uh, you can also find me on youtube and on itunes